Good morning guys, welcome back to a, another vlog. So this week, I swear I will be doing a weekly vlog. I said that last week, but then I had to end up splitting it into two different vlogs because I had so much footage, but this week I'm just going to put everything into one vlog because that's what you guys also want to see. But it is like 12.30 right now. I'm all showered up. I worked out this morning. I didn't show you because it really wasn't that interesting. I just did a Heather Robertson workout. I'll have the exact one that I have linked, that I did link down below. And then I just walked on the treadmill for five minutes just as like a cool down. I like just washed my hair. I like to wash my hair every single Monday because it just makes me really happy. puts me in a good mindset going into the week. But I have a pretty hefty to-do list today. I think I'll just show you guys. This is my new planner. You guys would have seen that in my most recent vlog. Um, it's from Erin Condren. I customized it so it says like... I heart coffee and getting shit done and it says my name on it. I got the vertical weekly spread just because it works the best for with what my weeks look like. So this is kind of how I categorize everything. Um, I just put grind day at the top because I have so much shit to do today. Um, but up here I do like my personal stuff and down here I do work related things. So for my personal to do, <laughs> I have manifest, workout, post items on Depop, water plants, and ship out a candle. I guess it could kind of be like workout, work related. Um, and then for my work, I have start new vlog which i can actually cross off um edit a vlog one of my vlog goes live i need to film a sponsored integration and i need to film a hoodie slash crew neck video which will hopefully be getting up later this week the major thing i like about this planner is how it's split into three different sections so you can categorize your to-do list which i love so like i said i just do like work and personal and then there's also this little section down here and i think i'm going to utilize that for my uploads that are going live on that day so for example today i had a vlog going live tomorrow i have a self-care vlog with Bally body going live and then hopefully on friday i'll get the hoodie slash crew neck video up because i do have to send it over to Anna louisa for them to review it because you guys know I'm an ambassador for them. If you guys didn't already know, I make candles just for fun and I sell some of them. So um, some of you guys have been buying them from me and specifically I had to make one of those female body ones. I don't know if you can see it, it's like right there, but I swear to God, this is my fourth time, third time redoing the candle because the first time I took it out and it snapped. And then the second time the bottom was cracked um, and it was uneven near the base. So I had to redo it and then I just took it out again and it snapped in half The female body ones are so freaking hard to take out of the mold because the silicone mold is so thick And it's just like literally driving me insane So I don't know if I can do those female one female body ones anymore I just need to find a different mold because it keeps breaking because the mold is so thick Also, this is like the major thing I want. I pulled out the camera for I have some room updates. So you guys know if you've been here for a while, you would know that I'm currently in the process of doing a room maker and room makeover. And I just got an email from Urban Outfitters. Lamp for my desk has been shipped out, but it's gonna arrive February 12th, which is still a very while. I guess it's only like two weeks away. But I also have some candles arriving today from Indigo. Um, so hopefully I can update you guys with that, but I went to Ikea last night I placed an order for click and collect so you it's so cool. Actually, you just park They have like designated click and collect spots So I just you park in a spot There's like a sign outside of the parking spots that gives you a number to text And then you just give your order number your name and what spot you're in and they just bring it to your car It's pretty cool, but I'll show you guys what I ordered. So if you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen that I was selling my side table and then I sold it to my boyfriend's sister. Um, so we went to see her in Kingston on Saturday and I just brought it to her. But the reason I was selling it is because I really wanted this side table. I'm obsessed with it. I'll have it linked down below. The one thing that I absolutely love about this is you can take this off. So I'm still trying to figure out if I want that there or not. It definitely looks a lot better if this isn't here. But also it's a lot more practical to have that because I just have like my sleep spray, my Kleenex, my Laneige sleep mask. So it definitely isn't as visually pleasing, but 
I do have stuff that I need to put in there because I want to keep the top like pretty clean. Um, so it also has like three different, I don't know if you can see, there's like three different sized poles and then there's a short one up here. So the table is adjustable. You just have to like play around with the placement of everything, which is really cool. So I have a pretty high bed, so it's the perfect length, but say I do move into a different space and I want to make this as like a table in the living room, I can like take this off and make it shorter. It's pretty cool, honestly. And I'm just gonna leave this on for a few days and like see how I like it. If not, I'll take it off. I saw Emma Rose Legger has a side table like this and I see it all over Pinterest. And the one that she has specifically is like $400. So I found a dupe for it. So I will have it linked down below if you guys are interested in getting it. So I got that yesterday. And then I also picked up these little candle catch trays. They're like a dollar something, dollar fifty each or something. Um, and it looks really cute with the bubble candle in there. The This is a stupid female body that keeps breaking. Like, I can't even look at her right now. She's pissing me off. So I got three of those candle trays. And then I have my bubble candle on this side in there. And then I just have that there because I don't know what I'm going to put in it. But I also got some planters. So I just got this woven one. I need to repot this plant. Because I don't want the terracotta. So I need to pot that in like one of these plastic plant tray things. And then stick it in there. And then I also picked up this pot. I think it's so cute. The plant I have is like too small for it. So I have a bunch of sticky notes in the bottom. And I just stuck it on top. But I love the white with the beige accent. I think it's so cute. And then I also got this little white plastic pot for my pothos. Right now I'm going to do my makeup, do my hair after, and get filming a video. So I will update you guys in a bit. Oh my gosh, there's already so many gone. Quit vlogging, idiot. It's so good. This is the best Krispy Kreme donut. I don't know what it is. It's like the original with whipped cream in it. Are you guys excited? <laughs> so I did not get to filming the hoodie slash crew neck collection because I got carried away with filming sponsored integrations. And <clears throat> my throat is so dry right now. I don't know why it's like that, but I just filmed like two back to back. I don't know what's going on, but I can't do that today and I'm gonna have to film it tomorrow, which is fine But I have two packages to show you guys So one of them is from Isle of Paradise and I'm so excited about this So they reached out to me on Instagram and like loved my content and stuff and wanted to send me their Isle of Paradise self tanning face drops I actually have the little like mini tester of it that I got from Sephora and I'm obsessed with it That is like my holy grail face tanner so I'm really excited to get the full size one. So if you are watching this, I love paradise. Thank you so much. And I'm so excited about this. I will have it linked down below if you guys are interested in getting it. Oh my God, look how pretty this packaging is. Self tan for everybody. It's like wrapped up in this cute little Isle of Paradise printed wrapping paper. Aw. <gasps> Aw, it's like wrapped up in like purple tissue whatever that is that was in my other pr box that is so cute oh wow <gasps> yeah so this is the other one i have i have the shade medium the medium is honestly like pretty dark so this is like the perfect self tanning shade when you guys are like pasty like me so i will have that linked down below i just need to snap a photo for instagram okay <laughs> so excited. Okay, and the next box is from Indigo. I believe I mentioned earlier, but I ordered a few candles online for my room, which I am so excited about. Say that about every freaking package that I get. They're like the tall tapered ones, like the ones I have from Urban Outfitters, kind of. I'll show you. Um, like the same style as those. I was looking at some on Ikea because I was going to order it the other day um, when I picked up my order yesterday, but all they had was white and I already have so much white going on in my room where just like I needed different colors that were still obviously neutral, but um, just something other than white. So I believe I picked up a cream colored one 
and a like peach. I'm not too sure, so we're gonna have to open it up the way I already forget what I ordered. So one of them is definitely a lot more orange than I remember it to be, but it should be fine. So I got the peach and a buttercream one. So here is the buttercream as you can see in the bottom here and then here is the peach so it's a little like peachy obviously um but i think it'll be cute in my room so i definitely need some like neutral pops of color let's take this out of like this little packaging oh i hope those fit is there like a generic size for candles i don't know here's the two colors to kind of give you guys an idea so this is the buttercream one this is like beautiful i was gonna get two of these but i just didn't know if that would be too much of one color so they also picked up this one i don't know though it's kind of like really peachy i'll make it work though it's fine it's still very neutral but i'm just worried if these are like gonna fit in my candle holder so let me get one to see i have one coming from urban that it may fit in but i have some of these from the thrift store that i really don't think it's gonna fit in yeah like you guys can't see it like don't fit <laughs> so what am i supposed to do if i like shave it down at the bottom or something I don't know if you guys like have any suggestions maybe let me know but they're beeswax i don't think they have a scent but i'll have them linked down below um hopefully my other candle holder will fit but updates to come okay guys okay guys moment of truth will i be able to take this out without it breaking it still looks very nice at the bottom though i just need to take it slow and not rush. Oh, okay. I got it out without it breaking. Hi guys. So I'm going to show you guys how I like to pack my candles because okay my dad works at a print shop so he made up these like little i did the designs and he just printed them out for me but it has like baby tay and then candle care instructions on the back so i just want to bring you guys walk you through how i like to pack them it's very therapeutic for me and i love it so i ordered a bunch of these boxes on staples and they're just like the ones that come flat and then you have to fold them up. So I also have this huge thing of bubble wrap. <laughs> it was only like $20 and I didn't know it was going to be this big, but I have a lot. And I basically just wrap each indivi individual one a good amount, obviously because it is going in the mail. Just fold it up. Then I have one ready for the box. And the bubble one, it doesn't need a lot. I can probably actually cut a piece off from here. So I had the famine, this is the little baby bubble. You can hear tinsel scratching it to get in. And then this one, I can just Stick in here. Psycho bitch. And then I just stick my little baby take handle in there. And then you push this down. I'm going to tape it up. And I think the tape is in the garage, so I'll be back. What? You're horrifying. You're me. Just tape it up. This is the easy part. And then I also have these fragile stickers. I need to go print the label. And then I just have these little slips from Amazon that you can put the paper in and it peels off. And then I just stick that 
on the top it's not that interesting so i won't show you guys that but that is like the little process of me boxing it up and it's just very therapeutic and fun <laughs> It's like 121. I have been doing computer work all morning. I just finished editing a vlog. I got it sent over for review. I literally look like Buddha right now. <laughs> and I just oh, Kitty's already asserted herself into the box. She always says that. It's a perfect size for you, actually. You Bailey. You wanna show Kitty? <laughs> Bailey's like throwing up. <laughs> Stop. Ew, what are you doing? Anyways, look at kitty. <laughs> I just got a box from Amazon. So get out of the way. Go there with Jingle. So an Amazon seller reached out to send me one of those starry light projectors. And these were so popular um, when quarantine first started. Like almost a year ago. And I just honestly never hopped on the trend and got one. So I'm really excited about this. And I just feel like it's really going to elevate the vibes in here at night so i thought i would open it up right now i'm just about to get ready and film a video i didn't have time to work out this morning but i am going to force myself to work out tonight and i will do it i'm holding myself to it but i'll also show you guys this like lit up at night because as you can see it's very bright in here right now it's not gonna work but i will have this link down below if you guys are interested in getting it if you haven't got your hands on one Oh, you can connect your music to it too. That's kind of cool. It's also white too. Whoa! What do you smell? What is that? What is that? Oh my goodness. Remote as well. I got the white one, but I believe they also had black. And I need to put batteries in here. Oh, you're the bestest boy. Yes. Perfect! I love you. Oh my god. I have the perfect spot for it too. On my new side table that you guys would have saw yesterday, there's like this huge base. It's perfect if I kind of just leave it here. I mean, it's not the most aesthetically pleasing thing, but it will work. Hey yo, vibe check. morning vlog happy wednesday i have not vlogged at all today um it is 1 50 right now and i have my hair like all sleek backed sleeked backed sleeked back with my whey pomade i'll have that link down below it's actually amazing and i have on my little garage matching set and i just took instagram photos in my mirror i just i didn't vlog it because i did that setup where i have my desk chair here and then i lean my mirror up against it i'll show you also i switch back to the mirror case that just really cute and simple i just need more photos i just need to start taking pics in my room more um but i am about to try to take off my nails because they're so so long and so grown out and honestly the nail salons just aren't gonna be opening anytime soon my starry light last night Oh my god, I'm gonna have it linked down below. It's actually iconic, but I need to list a bunch of this stuff on my Depop. I will get to that today. Here's my to-do list. Um, today is my rest day, so as you can see, my weeks start off, start off really hectic, and they get slower throughout the day, so I got Instagram photos. Can do that. Um, continue vlog. My vlog goes live. I posted another vlog today. I've honestly given up on Monday, Wednesday, Friday because I just have way too much footage. So I'm just going to upload whenever videos are ready. So I need to do my nails, post items on Depop, and I have to pick out some Yes Style stuff. Um, 
But before I do that, I want to see if I can fit any of those things in here. Because I'm just trying to like declutter my room. I think I'm honestly going to move those into my closet too. Because it's just really starting to annoy me. Um, not that there's any room. It's just going to be really cluttered in there. But oh well. As of right now, anyways, I'm just going to try to fit everything in here. Like this is already like really cluttered but honestly i can definitely go through this stuff because i don't need a lot of it so actually let's do that now i'm gonna listen to the girls bathroom <laughs> So I just stuck the ring light and the tripod in my closet, whatever. I'm just going to have to deal with it. And then I just have all my electronics in here. This was where my makeup bin was, but then I moved it to my bathroom just because it makes sense. My makeup mirror is in there anyway, so I have to walk in and get that anyways. But it actually looks so much better. Oh, I thought that was my cat. I was like, F um, It looks so much better without my ring light and everything there so i'm thinking i honestly like might move my desk over a bit because there's like a lot of empty space over there so i'm just gonna see like how close it just needs to be a few inches out from that so i can move it over like a decent amount not right now as of right now, I'm going to try to take off my nails. I don't, I'm just going to try to do what they do at the, I'm just going to try to mimic what they do at the nail salon. It's where they put acetone in a cotton pad and then put that on each finger inside of the, is this twin tin foil? I don't really know. You guys will get what I'm doing. I kind of gave up because the acetone was drying out my fingers really badly. So I just kind of cut them and shaved them down a bit. I can't tell if it's worse or better. I'm thinking it's a little bit worse. But I'm just going to sit and watch some YouTube videos and relax a bit on my rest day. And then I will tackle this. <laughs> I've just been putting it off because I, uh, it's so annoying, but I need to do it. Good morning guys, happy Thursday. <laughs> I have not vlogged at all this morning. I've just been doing a bunch of computer work and I just like got a thumbnail for a video that needs to go live tomorrow. So I've been super busy, but I did a Heather Robertson workout. Again, I'll have the exact one that I did linked down below. Um, and then I just showered and washed my hair. Ugh, you guys know washing my hair is my favorite thing. Oh my God, my battery is flashing. Anyways, as I was saying, um, garage sent me a secret package like I have no idea what is in this but there's a new um, social media marketer at garage and she reached out a few days ago saying that she just picked out a few things for me um, and sent them to me so I actually have no idea what it is but I'm so excited because obviously I usually always pick out my clothes from there so I know what's coming but this is like a nice surprise so I'm gonna give you guys a little haul and then you guys will definitely will definitely post some Instagram photos and everything and I'll try it on for you but I'm so excited it's kind of stressful because like you know your body the most and like what will work on you um, but obviously I'm very very grateful that I even get this package like this is so amazing okay guys this is like my raw reaction to okay so i've literally been wanting okay i have this in black but i want another one and i almost ordered this one because i placed an order on garage today actually for this really cute set i'll have it on the screen here but i've been wanting this for a while to match with my little nude set so i'm so excited about this these are the best bras ever um in a size small i'm normally an extra small but i'm hoping it will still probably be fine i'll make it work guys they sent over a pair of jeans Ooh, these are actually really cute so they're the jambi jambe large wide leg these are super cute in a size one they look like they actually fit me perfectly um and they have like this really cool chunk like slit on the right knee super cute i actually only have one pair of black jeans so i actually 
need more and this color is like beautiful so and then lastly they sent me a shacket so this is one of their new items guys i'm literally on garage like every other day because i'm obsessed with their clothes i have this in black and white but they came out with a nude color are you kidding me are you kidding me <laughs> i'm so excited so the one that i have is a size large but this is a small which is amazing because my other one's in a large and it's pretty oversized or this one is going to be a little bit more fitted but i guess i can try this on for you guys right now and show you what the outfit looks like i'm so excited i actually need to take instagram photos so maybe i'll actually like wear this right now are you kidding me this is the cutest thing oh my gosh i absolutely love it can't get over this jacket it's brown but it's neutral it's like also kind of nude oh guys i'm obsessed and the jeans like actually fit me amazingly i love it okay so i will have all these linked down below garage if you're watching this thank you so much um and i'm actually going to i think do my makeup and hair and everything right now and maybe get some instagram photos so i will link my everyday makeup routine because i have a whole video based on that <laughs> morning <laughs> guys it is so cold out if you guys live in Ontario, like I do, just comment if you remember Friday because this is like I'm actually, this is the coldest it's been for the year. Like I'm absolutely freezing. Anyways, good morning. It is 11.23 and I'm on my way to Starbucks because I actually haven't got Starbucks in like a week. So I'm trying to do, I'm trying to do like trying to limit myself to the amount of times I get it so I'm just gonna get it every Friday to treat myself because that sounds good and the fact that it's literally freezing out and I'm still going to get an ice drink is kind of psychotic of me but I just it feels right <laughs> and then I need to get more flowers for my room because I've had the baby's breath for a very long time almost a month now they've lasted a long time but they they're like starting to die and like fall out and everything so i need to get some new ones i think i'm going to switch it up and get some white roses though um instead of the baby's breath so i'm just going to check at metro because i believe they have i'm <laughs> guys i can't um because i believe they have flowers if not i can call the floral shop but i looked online at the floral shop to see if i could order online because i thought i remembered her saying that um and they just had like bundles also guys look at my phone case i got the aries one it came in the mail yesterday it's so cute and what else do i need to i need to fake tan so i actually like exfoliated and moisturized and everything so when i get home i'm gonna fake tan probably watch some bridgerton i started that last night guys I'm only one episode in, but I really, really like it. So I'm probably gonna finish it over the weekend. I'm also, guys, I'm gonna do a giveaway for Valentine's Day because I have something planned. So make sure you're subscribed and make sure you're following my Instagram because you will see the updates of when the giveaway is. Most likely on my Instagram, but I'll also post it on my YouTube. So go follow my Instagram, but I'm really excited about it. It's super cute to give back to you guys because I f love you. Also, oh yeah, this is what I also want to say. One second. <laughs> Good, how are you? Good. Can I please get a grande ice caramel macchiato with oat milk, please? Grande ice caramel macchiato with oat milk? Yes, please. Um, that's everything. Yeah. Okay, Thank you. I ordered a super puff. Do you guys remember in my a few vlogs ago now? But I was talking about it, I didn't know which one to get. And I decided on one. So you guys will have to wait and see in future vlogs as to which one i get it feels so weird to do a weekly vlog today i feel like i'm not as good as weekly vlogs because i like to just vlog as much as possible over a few days because i feel like the content is better but let me know in the comments if you guys like the weekly like like this style of the weekly vlog better just let me know if you like the vlogs that i've been doing recently where it's just like a few days in my life or the full week let me know Thank you. Yeah. Can I have a straw as well, please? Sure and there. Thank you so much. You as well. Wait, yeah, I need to film my TikTok. I've literally been filming this TikTok. I've been drinking coffee for probably three weeks now. Let's go 
get some flowers. Cute. These definitely aren't roses. I don't even know what flower it is, but I just like how they're white and I bought two bunches I believe they're eight dollars each. It's not bad and I just put it in a mason jar I think it looks so cute and then I just put a the baby's breath in a separate Vase, I don't know if it looks like there's too much going on with like the three plants. I don't really know um, I'll think on it and if not, I'll move this into my bathroom. That's where I had it before but guys my Urban Outfitters package is here and guys, I tracked this the other day and it said it was going to be here like February 2nd. So I'm like really excited and I'll have this link down below. I, it was all over my Pinterest board so it was on back order for like at least a month. I ordered it on Boxing Day so it's been like just over a month. You guys will see in a second but I'm trying to decide if I want to put this one on my desk or put it on my side table so i just need to play around and see what looks better because i have this this little mushroom light you guys remember from ikea um but it's super tiny and my other side table was super small um so i needed something to kind of complement that and not overshine it now that i have a bigger side table i could definitely put it on i don't know on my desk and then we'll just have to play around and see what looks better but guys I'm so excited Is this upside down this is really messy this is really messy. Oh my god. Oh my god. Guys, it's literally beautiful. Oh my god. I can't screw it in. The ring. <laughs> oh, my tooth ring? It's not weird, I swear. There's a story, guys. Ready? Yes. <gasps> <gasps> Pretty. Do you think I should put it on my side table or on my desk? So I had the mushroom one on my side table. Mushroom one on your side table and that one on your desk. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Yeah. 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 Thank you very much. Jingo. Angel. Hello. Okay. Um, so yeah, I'm definitely gonna keep that light there because I tried to put the lamp on there and oh my god, you guys know I hate that. Uh, <laughs> there we go. Um, the lamp was too big to go on the table with the plant. If I took the plant off, then it worked, but I have nowhere else to put the plants. So I'll just keep the small one there. It's more practical. Anyways, so I just need to figure out where... Oh, guys, look at the setup. It's so cute. I posted this on my Instagram. I'm just remaking some clouds, but I just need to like figure out the placement of candles and everything. Guys, the room tour will be coming very, very fast soon because i'm just waiting on one more thing and i'm hoping that's going to be here soon it's from urban but look at that guys are you kidding me with the little cloud there just need to figure out if i'm going to put the lamp on that side or on that side i'm thinking this side and then maybe i can move the flowers i don't really know i'm going to have to play around with it but i'm going to put you guys on a time lapse while i do that and then show you the final product Okay hey guys, this is the best I could come up with right now. I really, really wanted the light on that side, but the flowers have to go on that side because it looks weird right under the plant. And I still think I, I can't have that baby's breath there. It just looks super weird. <laughs> I don't really know. Yeah. 